So Jerry Seinfeld has come out, speaking of baseball, swinging, yeah. <laughs> but not against a team. He is swinging against the, as what he says, the extreme left, mm. AKA progressives. <laughs> <laughs> I'm interested. And he is saying that they have just butchered comedy. Um, here wow. is his argument. It used to be you would go home at the end of the day, most people would go, oh, Cheers is on, oh, MASH is on, oh, Mary Tyler Moore is on, all in the family's on. You just expected there'll be some funny stuff we can watch on TV tonight. Well, guess what? Where is it? This is the result of the extreme left and PC crap and people worrying so much about offending other people. Mm -hmm. When you write a script and it goes into four or five different hands, committees, groups, here's our thought about this joke. Well, that's the end of your comedy. They move the gates like in skiing. Yeah. Culture, the gates are moving. Your job is to be agile and clever enough that wherever they put the gates, I'm going to make the gate. So on Jerry's 70th birthday, which is today, by the way, so happy birthday to Jerry, uh, let me be the first to say that he's right. I mean, more or less in big picture, he's 100% right. Uh, there is really no good TV comedy these days. You see a lot of drama, you see Succession, you see HBO cranking out a ton of stuff, Netflix cranking out a ton of stuff, but when it comes to just original sitcoms or original comedy shows, far and few between, and I think what he's saying is the reason for that is because of these committees, these, yeah. you know, the decision makers in Hollywood that basically look at comedy, which I think is one of the more like polarizing uh, genres, if you will, because it, it can offend so many different people, especially with your sentiments and modern day uh, sensibilities, et cetera. And more or less, I think he's correct because in the nineties in his heyday, you could say some things, you could make some jokes and people would laugh. And even if it was a little edgy, it would still fly. In this day and age, it sounds like he's kind of railing against that. Uh, and it's interesting because we've seen a lot of comics, especially from like his time, also kind of come out and take the same position. And now here's Jerry, one of the biggest voices in comedy saying the same thing.